Hi everybody, it's Clara Alexander and today I am reviewing brushes. I'm talking about which brush is the best for ultra strands. Hey, do you like my flowers? Beautiful, aren't they? <laughs> Got them specially for today's show. So in today's tips, I'm going to review four different types of brushes and I'm going to give you our opinion as to which of those brushes are actually best for your ultra strands. So the first brush I'm going to review is, can I have a drum roll? The Denim 5. So this is the Denim 5. Can you see that? It is a beautiful brush. It's really sturdy, as you can see. And if you brush it, it's so so strong you know the bristles are really really strong that's not going anywhere now what i love about this brush is that you can really position it against your old strands perfectly as you know with the old strand brushing you brush down and in down and in and this brush really holds well the only thing though is that it can be quite harsh and sometimes it can snag the ultra strands if you're very very light on the hand and you're very careful with your brushing then this is an option but based on everything that i've seen so far i will give this brush a six out of ten so i would say that it's not necessarily the best but it's not bad either so if you've got a denim brush which is the denim five like this and you're using it for your old strands that's perfectly fine just note that you do have to be very careful when you're brushing your hair because it is quite stiff let's see the next brush the next one is the manta hair brush i have got to tell you i love this brush absolutely love this brush I love it because it's stylish you know and you can put your fingers right here and brush your hair accordingly it is a beautiful brush if you look at the bristles they're like so soft so they flex with your hands as well get that in shot they just flex through so as you're brushing your old strands you can just imagine that it's just flexing over the old strands and I love the feeling that this gives you when it's against your scalp because it's so soft, it literally massages your scalp. If you've ever washed your hair with your strands in, use this just to massage your scalp slightly, gradually with circular mo movements, just going around very, very carefully, and you will get the best massage ever. I use this brush a lot, and I think that this is an awesome brush. It's probably the one of the most expensive ones, so you're looking roughly about 24 to 25 pounds for this type of a brush but i tell you it is definitely worth it and ultra strand loves this i give this brush a whooping nine out of ten so if you've got this brush the manta brush manta hair brush you can get it online that's awesome if you haven't i say go buy one because we love this brush and ultra strand loves it too the next brush that I'm going to be reviewing is the Tangle Teaser. Yay! Okay, and this is an example of a Tangle Teaser. As you can see, it comes in funky colours. I love the fact that you can get it in all different kinds of colours and everything and different shapes. And they're an awesome brush. I would say it's in between the Denim 5 and the Manta hair brush in terms of like rigidity. So it does have some flex, but it doesn't have as much flex as you would get in the Manta. But this is a perfect brush, especially if you've got tangles. Um, it's very great for easing those tangles out. Again, this is a good brush for Old Strands. Old Strands does love this brush. And I found that some people find that the Manta can be a bit, um, can be a bit, little bit too soft on their hair and they'd rather have a little bit more tension as they go for this. So this is what I'd call the next option. And I would say that this is good. I would prefer this definitely to Denim 5, but not to my Manta hairbrush because the Manta hairbrush still tops this. So I would give this a seven and a half out of 10. But if you've got a brush like this, then this is fine. Tangle Teaser will work definitely on your old strand. Older strands, 
doesn't mind the tangle teaser but it definitely still loves the mantra but this i still give it some high points so if you've got this brush if you've got a tangle teaser doesn't matter what shape what color what style that they are good and i would say continue with them um but if you want a softer bristle then definitely try the mantra the next brush that i'm going to review is denim finishing brush now this is a baby version of it and I absolutely adore this brush and I adore it for two reasons I adore it because it's quite small so it can just pop into your handbag but I also adore it because if I look closely it's got two levels of bristles and two different types so you've got the longer bristle which is almost like what you would have in a tangle teaser and then you've got the shorter bristle here and this is great because what happens is that the longer bristle will go against your scalp and the shorter bristles will go against your hair. So essentially, it will give you a very good finish. It really, really does give you that silky feeling that you're looking to have. And it's A-OK -okay to put it against your scalp because of the two different levels. I think that this is this brush covers everything everything that you would need in a brush for ultra strands this brush definitely covers i would say that um in terms of the tension it still does flex it is a bit st it's sturdy obviously than the manta brush but it's better than the tangle teaser in terms of flexibility and definitely better than the d5 from the um denim but I think that this brush covers all bases. It is an all-in-one package. And if you're looking for an all-in-one package, this brush definitely works. And I don't know, like, when I was thinking, what do I give this? Do I give this as whopping 10 out of 10? I think I'll give it a nine and a half. Just a nine and a half. Yeah, I would definitely say that if I had the choice between this brush and the Manta, I would go for this brush. Also on price as well, because this is much cheaper than the Manta and it delivers the same sort of, re of results. Okay, it's not as stylish as the Manta, but it is small enough to fit into your handbag, especially if you're going to get this size as well. And literally, you just carry it where you go because this brush really does work as well. And Ultra Strands loves this brush. So, in order of best to worst, um, I'd say this is the best brush. So this is the denim finishing brush. And I would say that the next one would be the Manta brush at nine. And then we've got the Tangle Teaser. And finally, the denim five brush. But even though we've rated it that way, all of them will work with all strands. So you can take your pick which one you're going to go for. I know what my choice is. Anyway, hope that's helped you in deciding which brush to get for all just strands. Till next time, this has been Tips with me, Clara Alexander. Take care. Bye-bye.